Welcome back to my channel Nubitech. So today I am going to show you a trick on how you can call someone through your internet and it will be totally anonymous. Um, so to know about this trick, follow up my video and to know the mechanism about how it is happening, do watch a full video. Go to Google and write www.poptalks.com The site will open up. You just have to scroll down. Find the place from where you have to call. Just scroll down and down. Write down the number in which you want to call. And also don't forget to select your country from where you are. Okay, after selecting the country, do call the number you want to call and just wait. It will start ringing. Okay, but sometimes this will take you to another page. Just click on that thing that will come on your screen and it will take you to that page. And do the same thing on that page also. Go to the call option and select your country and do call the number which you want to call. And wait for some time, it will start ringing. This time it won't take you to another page. This time it will genuinely ring. So just wait for it. So as you can see, it is showing connecting. Just tell you, allow your microphone, it will start calling. And make sure whoever you are calling must have that internet on on their phone. Then only they can receive it, else it will fail. Start about how it actually works. The mechanism behind is nothing. It is just that ki you use your broadband connection to make a phone call. That means that directly the internet, you know, making making the call from the internet, like it is converting your digital signals to analog. So this is generally generally called VoIP. Uh, so this is a technology. Full form is uh, voice over internet protocol. You saw that you are calling someone from the internet directly to someone's phone number. So how it is happening? The mechanism is nothing. It is just like you are calling someone. Your voice note is converting into digital signals over the internet, and when it reaches the destination. It is converted to analog signal and the receiver can receive your call. And the another advantage behind this is that the receiver cannot find out who are you. That is, you will get a virtual number and that will help you to keep yourself anonymous too. So this is a great thing when you don't have a balance on your phone and you can call someone from the internet directly and even you can call someone from your computer too you can have a computer to computer calls like this is generally a very good technology for everyone so you can see it is written as I said it can also make a call from one computer to another computer or to a traditional phone if the phone is connected to a special adapter. So just see the diagram, it will make you clear about its concept. Okay, so the next thing is the type of VoIP phone calls that can be made. There is three types that is uh, from analog telephone adapter of your VoIP phone or computer to computer using a software VoIP phone. And in my video, I have just uh, showed you how you can do it from your phone to another phone. So this is generally the VoIP architecture as you can see in this diagram. VoIP is a great topic to be covered. It is based, basically based on networking. So if you know many things about networking, you will understand it very clearly. It is a great topic. I have just showed you a little bit part of it that you can use it in your daily life. Hope you have understand the concept and gather some new knowledge and to get further more videos like this do subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends. Till that, goodbye. See you soon. Bye bye.